Uh, and is part of the I Did Not Make These Rankings podcast network, along with some other pretty amazing shows like An Evening at the Movies, Crime Rewind, Crush Gasm, Literature Reapers, Love is Black, Men are the Prize, Season to Season, The Simplest, and Toontastic Journeys. You can find all of these podcasts and more at IDN mtrpodcastnetwork.com Now remember, Masturbators is filmed before a live social media audience and it's a mature show that talks about mature things. It's not kid friendly, but if you want to listen with your kids that's on you. We warned you. Have a good day. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Masturbators Presents 3 on 3. My name is DeAndre Robinson and we have a good one for you. Let's see how to our friends though, starting with CJ. How you doing CJ? I'm doing great. This is a beautiful morning. Yeah. And Josh. <laughs> Man, I'm doing great, dude. I am excited for this list. It's like one that we haven't even did a bracket review on yet. Um, I don't think you even you haven't had a chance to have people vote on this one yet, right? No, and I, and I probably won't for a very, very long time. This, this oh, is one just, I just made. Yeah, I'm excited, man. We breaking this one in. Let's do it, mm-hmm. man. It's great. Oh, time. shit. Yeah. Version bracket. Yeah, yeah. Bring yeah it on. So we are going to do the third movie in the franchise bracket. We have a sequels bracket. We when I want to see what's the third best movie in the franchise is. Third best movie in a franchise. Is. Here's how this goes. It's going to be on three on three. So it's going to be a group of four. Two of us will, will pick the ones go on. And one of us will be to sit there and sigh. And just be mad at the, at the picks they pick. <laughs> the highest seed will always play low seed. There'll be a buy in the fourth round and the quarterfinals. There'll be a there's a one v one. We all will vote. The first one v one is in the third round, uh, and then we will decide the third place game when we get there. And like always, I did not make these rankings. Uh, these rankings come from Rotten Tomatoes. You got probably these Rotten rankings. Tomatoes. Blame Rotten Tomatoes. Also, yeah. kind of know how Josh thinks. Yeah. This is. <laughs> This is franchise, not universe. This is a difference between right. movie franchise and, and movie universe. Yeah. So Iron Man three is not the, the not the universe. It's its own franchise. Just because Iron Man's in, in, the, in the universe doesn't mean it's not in the franchise. So I want to yeah. say it. So you will see a lot of M- MCU characters yeah. third movies in this. Hey, that's fine. But, it's the third yeah. movie in it. So Iron Man three, Thor Ragnarok. Those mm-hmm. are third movies. Uh, yeah. Also, uh, also, I'm pretty sure like, we're all going to be like pretty close to the vest on all these. We're all gonna be pretty close, mm-hmm. you know. Yeah, I was just saying, though, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good thing Casey's not here because yeah, he'd be feeling, feeling bad on this. Who's that? So, Avengers, you got, yeah, no, yeah. Yeah, you know, yeah. on, and then no, yeah. no, 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 Avengers, no, it'd be Avengers, uh, if any that, that's the third one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. yeah I was saying, like, you know, all of us are usually like pretty, like, you know, together on like most of the fucking characters and the most of the fucking things on like these movies. Well, was like, yeah, no, no, Casey was here, dude. He feeling bad. It was like he'd be voted out of pretty much everything. <laughs> all right, with that being said, <laughs> let's, uh, yeah, let's yeah, do yeah. our. Your face said it all. Yeah, that, that was the confirmation. <laughs> let, let, let's do uh let's do the play in first. CJ and Josh, you are first. All right, let's All do right. it. CJ, you gonna go first. So it's got Crocodile uh, Dundee, Los Los Angeles. Yeah. Uh Friday 13th, part three, Beverly Hills Cop three, and Little Fockers. Uh oh damn. Okay. Uh, 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 uh Crocodile Dundee. Dundee or Little Fockers. Uh Oh, and I'm going little fuckers. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, both of y'all damn mind. Beverly Hills Cop 3 is the best one. I knew you was going to be salty on that. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 know, I, I immediately went away from that because I knew how you said about it. Yeah, I said it. All right. No. With that being said, uh, we're going to get into the bracket. All right. It's with uh, Josh and myself. Josh, you're first. Got All number right. one, Goldfinger, 1964. Number two, Toy Story 3, 2010. Number 99, Alex Cross, 2012. Or number 100, Divergent Series, uh, uh, Elegant, 2016. Mm, I am going to go with Toy Story. Uh, okay. That was the most obvious one. Right. Uh, <laughs> right. Yeah, definitely. Um, 
just just because I, I want I want some black some color in this, I'm gonna go Alice Cross. I, I, I'm not a big. Is that Jay the Brown one fan. with Tyler Perry? I've never heard of it. It is the one with Tyler Perry. <laughs> they yeah, remade I've never heard of Alice Cross. That movie series. Well, mm. the original one had Morgan Freeman. Uh, you know, along with the Spider. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah, <laughs> yeah. Then they try to reboot it with uh, um, Tyler Perry. Oh boy, yeah. Oh, they try. Oh, they, they are coming out with a movie series, a TV series like that. Josh said. That. Yeah, it's a TV uh, show. Yeah. Yeah, with Alec Hodges. Yeah, no, yeah, no. The first one was Hodges. I'm excited for that. I hope that goes well. Me too. Because I like Alec Hodges, man. If you watch, it watch Leverage. I mean, yeah, he's, he's, I don't know. Archaeology is fucking amazing, but mm-hmm. Tyler Perry with uh, I, 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 I was, I was, I don't, I was yeah, I, for him I don't in this think movie, dude, just because I, I wanted to see him right do hands. well yeah. in a movie where he wasn't dressed in drag. I wanted to see Tyler Perry show, like, hey, I can act. In... Yeah. Anyway, oh, no, the bad no, thing, no, the, no, bad, no, the bad, no. bad thing is though, I like, I like Tyler Perry. I like all, all, almost all Tyler Perry movies outside of Medea movies. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, dude, dude, no, you know, if it's not a Medea movie, it shit's fucking amazing. Like he has fucking great. The the Medea movies are like is the Medea movies is pretty much just the same movie over and over again. They do be cringe and yeah, 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 they, yeah they basically no, no. do be the same. If you see anyone, you've seen them all. You know, all right. but uh, yeah, his, yeah, but like you know, his other movies though are fucking amazing. You know, but yeah, yeah, I'm just worried about him doing like something this big. Is like, is he is he a director or he's just an actor in it? No, no, it, it was this was a long time ago. He's not even in the franchise anymore. Oh, okay. All right, all right. so it's on me and CJ. I'm first. We got number three, War of the Planet of the Apes, 2017. Number four, The Lord of the Rings, Return of the King, 2003. Number 97, The Karate Kid Part Three, 1989. Or number 98, Taken Three, 2014. Take it uh, I'm first. Oh, sorry. All right, go ahead. And I am well. I'm looking you picking, so I'm going to go Karate Kid Part Three. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, you know, you know, if you're taking, if you're taking three, I went with Karate Kid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm not a big. I'm not a big Lord of Rings fan. I'm not. No, like I think Return of the King won a couple Oscars and stuff like that. But yeah, no, no. Um, I didn't know Return, Return of the King was the best of the three. I'm not worried. But, like, but at the same time, though, the second one, I mean, the first one was boring as shit. You know, the third one had like some action in it, but it was a lot of fucking talking and running like, bullshit. And, and walking. Like, you know? and yeah. Walking. walking. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. The third one was actually action and fighting almost the whole movie. You know? All right. So, CJ and Josh, CJ, your first. Number five, Logan, 2017. Number six, Thor Ragnarok, 2017. Number 95, 2012, Ice Age, 2011, or number 96, Rush Hour 3, 2007? Thor Ragnarok. Josh. Gotta go with Logan, man. Okay. That shit still gets me when she takes that cross and turns into an X. Mm-hmm. Yeah, to me, and I said it, and I always say it again, Thor, not Thor, uh, Logan is the second best superhero movie of all time. Yeah, I said it. Man. I'm, I'm really? Sticking with I'm sticking wow. with that. I do this. I I don't. I still don't understand why people. But uh, I mean, I'll have to watch it again. You know, mm-hmm. I don't understand why people give it so like give it so much accolades. Because like, yeah, I was bored through a lot of it. That's on you. Uh, but uh, I was yeah. not. I love that movie. Uh, yeah, Josh, right, it's just on Josh yeah, and myself. It was, it was hella boring. So on Josh and myself. Josh, your first number seven. The Boar Ultimatum, two thousand seven. Number eight. Skyfall, twenty twelve. Number 93, D3, The Mighty Ducks, 1996. Or number 94, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 3, 1993. Shit, man. Gotta go with D3. Damn you. <laughs> <laughs> the, only good, the only good pick out of those four. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sometimes the page go first. I'm, 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 going, I'm going when Turtles go back in time. I'm going, I'm going Turtles 3. You know, honestly, I probably would have picked that if you had picked D3. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 That movie fucking sucks. So, mm-hmm. uh, dude. Right. But out of, those, out of those four, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, uh, it's on me and CJ. I'm first. Number nine, Barbershop, the next cut, 2016. 
Number 10, Captain America Civil War 2016. Number 91, Inferno 2016. Or number 92, Cloverfield Paradox 2018. I am going to go Captain America Civil War. Of course. Well, <laughs> that is definitely. All right, I'm going with uh, the first movie. Barbara Shop Next Cut? Yep, there it is. That's the one. <laughs> Good picks. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, no, I didn't, I didn't even remember what it was. It was uh, yeah, Barbara Shop was down here fucking, uh, yeah. Uh, Inferno. Civil War, the, Civil, War, Civil War is the only choice I vote for. Is that the one that's like the sequel, the third one in the Da Vinci Code series? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, wait. What is Inferno. Inferno? Oh, I, I didn't even watch it. That did not look yeah. good at all. Uh, the, all right. Even the book wasn't that good. Yeah, no, like, all, I mean, no, the, the first two were really good. Yeah, yeah, especially yeah. the first one. The original was amazing. Mm-hmm. Well, right. the fourth book, I hope they make that into a movie because that's really good. It's about AI. Okay. So I'm going CJ and Josh, CJ's first. Number 11, Harry Potter and the Pris- Prisoner of Azkaban, 2004. Number 12, John Wick, Chapter 3. Number 89, Blade Trinity. Or number 90, Resident Evil Extinction, 2007. Oh, you're an asshole. <laughs> All right. That's fine. <laughs> All right, um, shit. Uh, I'm going with Prisoner of Escobar. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, what are the other three options? I know Blade was one of them. Harry Potter, sorry, sorry. Resident Evil Extinction, Blade Trinity, John Wick Chapter 3. We'll go John Wick chapter three. Yeah, and, they, and I knew you. I knew you go. Yeah, if I pick Harry Potter, you get chapter John Wick. Yeah, so all right, all right, all right. Either way, I'll save here. All right, but Josh, but I want to be the one to pick Harry Potter. All right, Josh and myself. Josh, your first all number right. thirteen, Creed three, twenty twenty four. Number fourteen, A Quiet Place, Day One, twenty twenty four. Number 87, Friday at the Next, 2002. Or number 88, The Beverly Hillbillies, 1993. I'm going to go with Creed 3. Oh, what? I uh, know it's controversial, <laughs> but I actually what? like Creed 3. What, 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 I what enjoy floor? that. It has the whole little Naruto theme where they just fight. In the... People yeah, either yeah, hate yeah. that scene or they like that theme. I right, like wait, what's the, theme what's the, four, the fans go away and they're just fighting in the dark. All right. All right, well then I uh, I gotta go Friday the next, but I yeah, really that's, want you to pick. Uh, I really uh, want you to pick Friday the next, so I can pick the Beverly Hillbillies. That shit's gotcha. hilarious. Man. See, I will. Oh, the, the movie Beverly Hillbillies, dude. You pick Creed three over Beverly Hillbillies. All right, I so Friday after next. I mean, I mean, I, I mean, I, I mean, I mean listen, he he, he oh, get to pick what he wants. He get to pick what he wants. All, all right, right. I, you, you're right. He can't pick what he wants. No. Because no, we're not all in the same house, dude. Like I can't run in there for Peter Chef from the room. All right. Yeah. Well, here we go. All so right. me and CJ, I'm first. Number 15, Day of the Dead, 1985. Number 16, The Dark Knight Rises, 2012. Number 85, Saw 3, 2006. Or number 86, Look Who's Talking Now, 1993. <laughs> All right, let me hear the moment. Look who's right, talking I, now. I, I already know what I'm not thinking. But yeah. Look who's talking now. Dead the Dead, Saw 3, The Dark Knight Rises. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going Saw 3. All right, y'all gonna hate me for this, but I'm going. Look who's talking now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, listen, listen, listen. I, 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 I love, I love the. Look, I love the look who's talking over the Dark Knight Rise. Look, 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 look. I love, I love, I love doing the voice. I love doing the voice. I love doing the voice. Oh, you, you, you think darkness is your ally? I was born in the darkness, <laughs> but, but look who's talking now is, is, is very yeah. underrated. Very good, choice. Right, good yeah, choice. Yeah. I like it. No, no, no. The thing is, the thing is, I do for you. It would be a choice between, uh, between like, uh, yeah, the third one wasn't even a fun category. No, no, it was, uh, it was look who's talking Henry or Dark Knight Rises. Yeah, but uh, if it was the other one, it was just a Dark Knight though. 
Oh, be that, easy yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah, that would have made you fucking think more. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, yeah. uh, it's on CJ and Josh. CJ, your first. Number 17, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly, 1967. Number 18, The Return of the Pink Panther, 1975. Number 83, My Big Fat Greek Wedding 3, 2023. Or number 84, Pitch Perfect 3, 2017. Why are you talking to me in the scrubs? <laughs> all, right, all, right, all right. I'll go Pitch Perfect 3. All right. Josh? I'm going to go with My Big Fat Greek Wedding 3. Which wasn't a bad movie. I mean, no, as, I, as, I, as, I, as, I, as a rap. Is yeah, there, is I, a rom -com? Yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, I, you know, I haven't seen them. I, I won't see the first one. The first one's uh, fucking hilarious. Third one is the one where, oh, I won't spoil it for nobody. Nope. But yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I like yeah, that whole yeah. thing. Yeah, please, please don't spoil it for me. Like, oh, no, yeah. I always just forget that it's a thing. Mm -hmm. I, you know, yeah. All right, Josh. I just remember the, I watched the first one many times. The first one's hilarious. The grandma is my favorite character. She's fucking mm -hmm. amazing. Yeah. All right, Josh. This next one, I'm, I'm basically giving you a toss up. Right. It's, it's, it's in between you and I, you're first. <laughs> no, number, or, matter or or am I? God, I'm sorry, sorry, I spoke too soon. But anyway, you're first, Josh. Number nineteen, Star Trek Beyond, 2016. Mm -hmm. uh, number twenty, Avengers: Infinity War, 2018. Mm. Number eighty-one, The Matrix Revolutions, 2003. Or number 82, The Expendables 3, 2014. How the fuck is it a toss-up? <laughs> How the hell? Oh, my God. What the fuck? I'm pretty sure I know what you're going to pick, which is great because it frees me to pick what I want to pick. Mm -hmm. And I ain't even mad at it because In the Darkness wasn't that great, but they brought it garbage. Beyond. Beyond was really damn good. This was Star Trek. The whole little movie series should have been. It had good yeah. action and everything. So I'm going to Star Trek Beyond. There you go. So uh, yeah, because I'm going uh, Alpha's going Infinity War. And yes, it's yep. a toss up. Toss up for me because I, I, it was either for me. It's the only movie that can, I could care about. This thing is Infinity War. Right. <laughs> everything, you, everything you said before this about it being a toss up one. and me going first in the category grouping. Right, and honestly, right, if, if, yeah. if it was just me by myself, I would have picked Infinity over Star Trek. Mm -hmm. um, but I knew you was gonna pick it. What was the what was the other one? What was the fourth one? The fourth one was was, was Expendables three. Yeah. Oh yeah. Which uh, outside yeah. of Frazier being it wasn't very good. Wait, yeah, yeah, Expendables three. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. So no, so no, there were yeah two people, three movies, and I don't know, no, two movies. Never mind. All right. <laughs> so, no, no, two no, no, right. no, 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 no movies that went through were the two movies that should went through. All right, so it's on me and CJ's. I'm first. Number 21, Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade, 1989. Mm. Number 22, The Spy Who Loved Me, 1977. Nope. Number 79, Police Academy 3, Back in Training, 1986. <laughs> or, number, or number 80, Transformers Dark Side of the Moon, 2011. I am first. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm first, right. and I am going Police Academy 3. <laughs> yep, I do. I do. Yeah, yeah. Yep. And I, you know, and I would go for the Transformers. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, no, no, the first two. Yeah, there was bad. No chance. <laughs> the first one, bad, no chance. Like, yeah, was that Police Academy? I'm like, all right, I'm picking that one. It was like Transformers. Oh no, no, no. Dre's picking the first one. No, Dre, no, Dre's picking that one, and yeah. I'm picking Transformers. <laughs> just, yeah. But I, so, I, dark I, truth, I, I, I thought that you would have picked uh, Indiana Jones though. I did too. No, no, that no, one's no, good with Sean no, Connery. No, 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 no. I actually said out loud that's the third one. Oh yeah, yeah. I really, yeah, no. It was, it was the third one. Yeah, it it was all right. I'm better than the first right. one. No, so the, the, the second the, the second one is the the second one is the best one. Period. Yeah. All right. So CJ and Josh. I already know what Josh going to pick. So CJ really is on you. All right. <laughs> So we got number 23, Star Wars Episode 6, Return of the Jedi, 1983. Ooh. Number 24, Guardians of the Galaxy, Volume 3, 2023. Number 77, The Fast and the Furious, Tokyo Drift, 2006. <laughs> or number 78, Glass, 2019. Oh, shit! What? Oh, wow. 
Oh, man, sorry. These are hitters. These are some hitters. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm this glad you go first. <laughs> man, yeah, 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 yeah. You were around with some hitters. Uh, all right, I already know. I do. I already know for a fact. Josh's going to fuck this up. Well, all right, all right, all right. Give me one, give me one more time. Sorry, uh, give me one more time. Glass. Glass. Yeah. yeah. Star Wars Episode Six: Return of the Jedi. Uh, Josh, Josh's pick, and Guardians yeah. of the Gal- Galaxy by a three. Yeah, I'll be, yeah, I'll be Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. All right, Josh. <laughs> Just for prosperity, go ahead and give me the options again. Glass, yeah. Star Wars Episode Six: Return of the Jedi, and your pick. You know what? <laughs> your pick. As you all know, I am a huge Fast and Furious fan. And unlike some people, I really do like Tokyo Drift. But I'm going to return to the Jedi. All right. Yeah. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, John, for not oh, for not fucking hey, I like that franchise, but I mean, no, no, no. Return of the Jedi is my no. favorite Star Wars movie, period. Well, Me no, too. it was my second favorite. No, I, I, I really like Revenge of the Sith. I no, like really. that a lot. No, dude, no, you know, fucking, uh, yeah, that's my favorite Star Wars movie too. But at the same time, though, fucking like we were scared though. You love them, fucking. I do. Uh, I you do. Love them if there had been some weaker movies, if Star Wars had been part of the equation, I would have picked. Dude, not the worst. Yeah, you would have picked the worst of the entire. But the DK, no, dude. You know what? It's not that bad. Terrible. Fucking drift, get the fuck out of here. That's well, right. Garbage. Was tied so, in the little soundtrack. No, 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 no. no. How do you, dude, how do you have an accent that's so bad that people think it's a fake accent? All right, no, 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 dude, that's garbage. <laughs> All right, so Josh is on me and you. You're first. Right. Number twenty five, Clear and Present Danger, nineteen ninety four. Mm-hmm. Number twenty six, Back to the Future three, nineteen ninety. Number seventy five, Rambo three, nineteen eighty eight. Number 76, Angel Has Fallen, 2019. You know, the one thing I've noticed over and over again is there's certain film series where I have a favorite movie. Mm -hmm. But as I get older, it changes. And when I was younger, I loved Back to the Future 2. But the older I've gotten, the more I really, really enjoy Back to the Future 3. And it's become my second favorite out of the franchise. First is still my favorite. So I'm going back to Future 3. I was hoping that would be on this list. I'm glad it's on that list. I love that movie. So I'm going to go with Rainbow 3. Um, just just because. Mm-hmm. Uh, I would have went with uh, Back to Future 3 as well. Because I think that Back to Future 3 is the second best movie in the franchise. I think the first one is overrated. Let's just be honest with you. I think the first one. I think the first one is the least one, the least favorite, best one. It, it will go two, three, uh, two, three, um, one for me. All right. So CJ is on me, you and me, you, you and I, uh, and then I'm first. So it goes twenty number twenty seven, Mad Max Beyond the Thunderdome, nineteen eighty five. Number twenty eight. <laughs> Star Trek Three: The Search for Spock, 1984. Number 73, Batman Forever, 1995. Or number 74, Scream Three, 2000. I am going Batman Forever. Nipples in the suit. Yeah. <laughs> All right, yeah. I'm, CJ, I'm going. Yeah, CJ, yeah. we don't need another yeah, hero. Yeah. <laughs> I we need what the Thunderdome. Oh, yeah, yeah. Dude, Master Blaster, bro, you can crack it. Yeah, dude, boy. Dude, when I was a kid, dude, when I was a kid, dude, like, oh, my God. Yeah, I, I first saw a Master Blaster. I was like, oh, my God. I was like, dude, that's the shit. That's yeah. And then I saw the uh, separation of Master Blaster. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, oh, my God, dude. I'm like, oh, my God. This is the weakest bad guy ever. <laughs> like, that movie was so corny, but I love it. Even, I was a kid. I thought, like, he's not even Nintendo worthy. <laughs> oh, <damn. laughs> All right. All right. So we just got CJ and Josh. CJ's first. Number 29, Iron Man 3, 2013. 
Number 30, Madagascar 3, Europe, Europe's most won in 2012. Number 71, Maze Runner, The Death Cure, 2018. Or number 72, Shrek the Third, 2007. Mm, damn. Some fucking good ass movies. Yeah. All right, show again. Shrek the Third, Iron Man 3, Maze Runner, The Death Cure, Madagascar 3, Europe's most wanted. Yeah. yeah. All right, Maze Runner. All right, Josh. Fuck, dude. I was really hoping you picked something else. <laughs> my choice yeah, so no, much that, harder no, now. No, that, no, that group of four was not good. <laughs> that is brutal. Uh, mm. I really love the Afro Circus song, but that's the only thing I really like about Madagascar 3. The first two are way better. Um, so I'm not picking that. So Shrek the Third or uh, Iron Man 3? Boy, and then Shane Black killed it on Iron Man 3. Like, that movie was so good in so many ways, especially considering he spent so much time outside what? the armor. What? And it had that yeah, whole spy yeah. thing yeah, to no, it. That's what Plus, you had the little boy it. and everything. Iron Man 3 was horrible. What are you talking about? I liked Iron Man 3 a lot. Iron Man I mean, 3 wasn't shit. Dude, dude, no, it was a spy no. movie. No, no, Which Jay Black called, that. No, no, no. It shouldn't have been called Normal Man. Because that's you what mean, it was. Like, movie. all movies. But you know, that was the thing. Iron Man, it took Iron Man for 10 minutes. Of a two-hour movie, a good Fuck superhero that. movie you can no, take no, the that hero, was man. That strip was him of man all and the, movie the stuff that normally makes them a hero, and then watch him still shine. And that's what we got to see. It stripped Tony down to the basics, and then we got to see him do his shit, and I liked it. You know what? Fuck it. I'm going Iron Man three. I was thinking of Shrek, but you you convinced me, CJ. Yeah. Sleeping Iron Man. Yeah. All right, so Iron Man moves right. on. Yeah, yeah, let's see the motherfucker get in this round. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, all right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I bet you, mo- I, dude, I bet folding money, no man that's made out of this round. <laughs> all right, so it's on myself and Josh. Josh, you're first. We got right. number 31, Deadpool and Wolverine 2024. Number 32, Escape from the Planet of the Apes, 1971. Got number 69, Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End, 2007. We got number 70, Final Destination 3, 2006. Oh, I'm going Wolverine Deadpool. Or Deadpool. That is an easy easy choice. Easy. And I'm going to go to me, and people people hate what I'm going to say this, but I thought that this, this one, the best Pirates of the Caribbean movie, yes, I said it, at World's End, that shit was hilarious. Oh, oh, no, the thing is, though, no, honestly, I thought you were going to go like some random movie other than that. I'm like, oh, I am so glad you picked that. Like, oh, no, I agree. No. I rose in. I mean, I rose in. It was fucking amazing. I would have yeah. picked it if, if the other choice hadn't been there. So, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. No, 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 I know that's exactly what I would have picked, too. Mm-hmm. All right. It's yeah. on me and CJ. I'm first. We got number 33, The Equalizer 3, 2023. Number 34, Bad Boys for Life, 2020. Number 67, Triple X, The Return of uh, 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 yeah, Xander. Xander, Xander Cage. Xander Cage yeah. number, number 68, Alien 3. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, don't, I don't know why I put a million with this guy. <laughs> you know why, damn it. You know why. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick fucking. Uh, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make this easy for fucking. I'm gonna make this easy for Drake. I'm gonna pick fucking Xander Cage. Oh, you could have picked Bad Boys for Life. I, I'm gonna pick Bad Boys for Life as well. But I went with uh, um, uh, Equalizer Three. Equalizer Three wasn't bad. Yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't bad, but like, I don't know, it was, it was, yeah, like a lot of times, like when I do the thing of fucking like trilogy movies, I, I I always compare them to like the others. You know, and, you know, Bad Boys for Life doesn't doesn't measure up. I, you know, actually that that's that's literally what we did last night was was we watched Bad Boys for Life and then fucking uh, you know, and then the uh, the new one fucking uh, Ride or Die. Uh, um, and Ride or Die was amazing. Dude, All right. yeah. Yeah, Bad Boys for Life does not compare at all. 
<laughs> All right, so we on CJ and Josh. CJ's first number thirty-five, a hunting in Venice, twenty twenty-three. Number thirty-six, Maxine, twenty twenty-four. Number sixty-five, Night at the Museum, the Secret Tomb, twenty fourteen. Or number sixty-six, Ice Age, Dawn of the Dinosaurs, two thousand nine. Oh, <laughs> we know exactly what two are going through. <laughs> yeah. CJ, not, one. not the museum. And then right, Josh, yeah. Josh. Yeah. Josh. I was gonna pick it even before CJ said I had to pick it, but yeah, we gonna Ice Age. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Tell me, tell me you haven't seen uh, Maxine without tell me you haven't seen Maxine. Maxine is actually pretty fucking good. I, you know what? I will say I never even all heard three, of it. I, on all three movies, I like Maxine the most. It definitely had that nice like exploitation feel to it, but I don't think it's better than Ice Age. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm actually three. Time. I think three is great. Oh man, it's so good. Uh, um, but no, Maxine was good. I've seen that whole trilogy. I hated Pro. I did not like that very much. I like you. X, you, you like Pro? I, I didn't care Pearl. for it. I, 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 it just it was too whimsical for me, and I know that's what they're going for. Mm. But it just it yeah, felt uh, yeah. it, it was boring to me personally because of it. It wasn't a bad movie at all. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Send me, send me, uh, Is it trilogy? Yeah, did you ever see the movie XXX? Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, God, I know what you're talking about. Like, yeah, yeah, so X it's Pearl Pearl that, 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 yeah, yeah. That, that, that's a 224 shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, shit. I'm, yeah. I'm good, I'm good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Listen, listen, H.A. Ford got some good shit. So, I mean, listen, they you really say how you want. H.A. Ford got some good shit. Everything, everywhere, all at once came in that, uh, uh, from H.A. Ford, and that shit was amazing. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The, the, that's who did that? Yeah, yeah. H.A. Yeah. Really? Ford does a lot. I mean, a lot of good shit. Really? All right. All right. I, I take it back. They yeah, do a yeah, lot of weird right. stuff, too, hey. but they do a lot of good shit. Shoot 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 the trilogy. Well, 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 everything all at once was weird as fuck, but it was so good. No, no, no. Every all at once was an amazing movie. Yeah. Yeah. Now, it's, don't get me wrong, it's not as fucking like super savage as fucking Dre puts it out to be, but it's fucking amazing. Movie. I've never said it was savage. When was going to say yeah. savage? I, 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 I think that it, when it first came down, that was the old thing you can fucking talk about. It was fucking good. It was it was great. It, it was could because because it, it was it, it came out within a time where they did a lot of multiverse shit. Everybody's doing multiverse shit, and I feel like that yeah. this movie yes. predicted multiverse way better than anything everybody's ever, ever, ever did. So I it was, agree. It was, yeah. it was pretty so good. I agree on that point. Yeah. All right, and yeah. and he had hot dogs with fingers. That shit was great. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going CJ and right, Josh. I agree with that. Right. CJ and Josh, you got number 37, Mission, <laughs> Mission Impossible 3, 2006. Number 38, Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines, 2003. Number 63, The Chronicles of Nordia, The Voyage of the Dawn Treater, 2010. Or number 64, Jurassic Park 3, 2001. CJ's first. Oh, shit. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for you, Josh. I'm sorry. I'm going to dress Parker. Which is the to me to me. I know. Yeah. To me, it's it's better. It's better than, than, better than two. Almost better than one for me. I know, dude. Dress Park three was fucking amazing. Yeah, three was three was gangster. I like. Yeah, you know, especially when they were like, yeah, he was like, oh, yeah, that one guy that like came into the vest and just left. If they came back and rushed us through it, mm-hmm. you may thought they were safe. Like, nope. Nope. <laughs> Josh. Oh, dude. What was the other three choices? Yeah. <laughs> Impossible Sorry. Three, The Chronicles of Nordia, The Voyage of the Dawn Treater, or, number, or Terminator Three, The Rise of Machines. You know what? I'm going to go with Terminator Three, The Rise of Machines. Yeah. I knew there was one of the Chronicles of Nordia. For I one reason, one, one reason only, most of the movie shit, but that final scene with John Connor accepting his fate and, and the end of the road's happening and he's in the bunker and then they're like, see anybody there? And he finally picks it up and you're like, oh, man. Like, that shit was yeah. actually a good scene. That was yeah. a really you know, good scene. You know, you know, I, think, I think that movie's a little underrated. I agree. You know, I, I agree. Know, like, I, I think like it's way too much hate. Yeah. I can like, like oh, some of the action scenes, some of the action scenes are like, Stupid, everything you know, but the storyline, you know, it was like really good. Like how they, you know, and how they did it was fucking good. You know, all right. So, so I'm Josh and myself. Josh, your first 
Number 39, Ocean's 13, 2007. Number 40, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, 1989. Number 61, Austin Powers Gold Member, 2002. Or number 62, American Wedding, 2003. American Wedding. Oh, you fuck! You... <clears throat> This is to me. This to me. This is the hardest grouping. Yeah, so, I know. Yeah, I like no, all these there's, movies. there's a lot of good ones. There are good movies, but I really um, like I am, American Wedding. I'm going Ocean's Thirteen here. Right. Really? Yeah, that's not. I'm going bad. Ocean's oh, <laughs> I'm going Ocean's and and when Emily hears this, she's probably going to kill me for not picking National Lampoon Christmas Vacation because she's. Thank you. That's what I'm saying too. Yeah, dude. I Christmas Vacation was a lot here. Ocean, Ocean, Ocean's 13 is legitly the best ocean movie. Uh, uh, oh, no, no, it definitely is. No, yeah, without and, a doubt. Yeah. Without I'm, a doubt, it's the best. And I'm not, I'm not a Christmas fan at all. So, there you go. All right. Look, so, I love Christmas Vacation. Don't get me wrong. Mm -hmm. Like, DJ knows. I mean, we watched that last Christmas have movie night and everything. Mm -hmm. I <laughs> like that movie. Yeah, 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 that was actually my suggestion. <laughs> but, you know, I mean... It, it, it was a hard choice. All right. So yeah, yeah, no, no. I, I, I get you. Don't know no, that. No, that is a fucking hard grouping. But well, mm -hmm. I thought vacation. I thought Christmas vacation was good. Kind of it is not. That hurt. That hurts. Not really hurts. Right. No, man. It's on me and CJ. C. Uh, I'm first. Number forty one. Cars three. Twenty seventeen. Number forty two. Hunger Games. Mocking Jay. Part one. Twenty fourteen. Number fifty nine. Lethal Weapon three. Nineteen ninety two. Or number 60, X-Men and Last Stand, 2006. I am first. I'm going X-Men and Last Stand, 2006. Uh, I'm going next on the Christmas Vacation. That's not on there. <laughs> I'm going to uh, Lethal Weapon 3. Oh, shit. Over, I, I, I could have sworn you going to pick cars. I do. No, I, nah, I couldn't get I can't get that. You one. haven't seen the third one, huh? No, I oh haven't. no, that was Josh to say he loved Cars 3. Yeah, yeah. Cars 3 is really yeah. good. You get a chance. The, the problem is the second one throws people off, and the second one's not bad, but it throws people yeah, off no, 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 how no. good the story from the first one was. Yeah, no, but wrong. the it's third like, one is yeah. amazing because the third one, you, you can skip the second one completely and just watch the first and the third, and it makes perfect sense. Yeah, All right. See, the thing is, I didn't. Yeah, yeah. I, I am know that till later, but I tried to watch the second one multiple times. Yeah, no. And you're sorry, Josh, but you're wrong. The second one is bad. It's, it's horrible. All every, right, so every time I try to watch it, it yeah. Well, we'll just skip and watch the third one. We're on CJ and Josh. CJ's first, <laughs> and right. I kind of know what CJ's pick gonna be already, but it is what it is. Number forty-three, Red Dragon, two thousand two. Number 44, Army of Darkness, 1992. <laughs> number, number 52, Reddick, 2013. I'm sorry, number 57, Reddick, 2013. Number 58, Crocodile Dundee, Los, Los Angeles. Wait, this is our real here. Yeah. We already did Los Angeles. We already did Los Angeles. Hold on, game minute. Let me make sure. Yeah, we did. So I got to put some else on somewhere. Sorry. Sorry, yeah. fellas. All right. Sorry. All right. Hey, cool. If it's not on the list yet, you should put what's in. Uh, what's up with shit? All right, all right. All right. Uh, Jack, are you going to pick up? Or are you going to pick up on Dundee, Los Angeles? No, 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 no. You're first. You can't ask that. Uh, oh, that means, that means if neither one of us is going to pick it, then it doesn't matter. You have to do less work. Okay. So, well, I wasn't so, going to pick it. CJ, yeah. who was going to pick? I wasn't, I wasn't going to pick it. I wasn't either. All right. Go ahead and make so a pick. All right, yeah, 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 all right, all right, you're good. Right, you well, for, for, for me and my and for when I gotta do this again, I gotta put some else on there. So, but go yeah, ahead. Put, all right, yeah, put something already already fucking disqualified. <laughs> all yeah. right, now what, what, what are the other two? What are the other three? It is the Red Dragon, Reddick, and Army of Darkness. Army of Darkness, there it is. Yeah, I knew that. Yeah, you knew I was gonna pick that. Yeah, Army of Darkness. I'm picking Red Dragon. Which, Which is an was really good. Movie. It, it's really interesting too because even though it's the third one in this series, it technically in the actual books came first. And they actually, even before Dude started playing Hannibal Lecter and we had Sons of the Lambs, there was a Red Dragon movie based on the books that came out. 
Really? There was? Yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I it's, it's a really old movie. It's not yeah. connected to the franchise yeah. or the series, which is yeah. why this is the third one. But yeah. But yeah, you know what I mean? Though, the Red Dragon movie, you know, that movie is fucking, I think it's just fucking phenomenal. Oh, it's a trip. It, it's phenomenal. And it's like, you know, it's more, more, yeah, more played. It's like, yeah, no, the movie Hannibal sucked, which is why I think the movie Red Dragon didn't do as well. You know, because yeah, right. they, yeah, because they, you know, because like Advertising and the Lambs, people saw fucking like Hannibal, and it was garbage, and like you know, most people didn't want to fucking go out and you know and try to see a prequel to fucking you know what they just saw. So I oh. found the, so so I but found where, movie but that Dragon was amazing. I found the next movie that should be on top to be the next to this. Um, so I'm going to, so you have Red Dragon and Armored Ducks moving on, but I am going to let you know that Exodus 3 will be replacing that. Cool. Okay. Cheers. And you may want to revisit this we list, Jay, because I know what you said about franchises versus third in the series, but technically, because of Manhunter, this is considered the fourth movie and not the third. Wait, say that again? What, 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 what's Manhunter? So in the whole Silence of the Lambs series, it goes Manhunter, which was the first one, Silence of the Lambs, then um, Hannibal. And so... So yeah. Hannibal will be the third one? Technically, but not... Re- I mean, if you're including the ones with Anthony Hawkins, then yeah, but it's really weird because Manhunter is the first one, but it's also based on Red Dragon. So you don't really need to change it up because, I mean, really, right. you're just looking after Hannibal Lecter films, even though they can <laughs> Hunter first. It's, it's, like I said, that's what I said. It's weird the way they did it. But um, yeah. it's a good movie, though, though. That's why I picked it. Yeah. So it's, actually, it's, actually, it's actually part of this. It's actually part of this series, though. So, 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 no, not so. I, I so I know, I know tomorrow with Manhunter. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, uh, yeah, I, I didn't say we see him. I just wanted to know. Is it actually part of this series or was it a I, separate I was, I series? I mean, a it's, separate it's thing. Well, a separate thing. Well, man, how, how, like outside of Wikipedia, outside Wikipedia, the, 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 nobody has Manhunter as number one. Yeah, yeah so. I mean, and honestly, it's a weird one, kind of like Alice Cross, where it's like, mm. yeah, there's two other movies before it, but it was a reboot of the whole entire thing. Mm. So, yeah, I mean, uh, technically, you don't really need to change it. Well, yeah, well, yeah, no, yeah. The thing is, no, the thing is, if though, if there's reboots or going to revisit. Then it's not part of the franchise. I mean, I, I'm not changing anything. So, yeah, uh, so, yeah, 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 so we we yeah, we yeah, keep no, it moving. No, no, yeah. Ja- no, it's it's yeah. on Josh you and myself. Technically, but, you know, no, no, technically, no, technically no, the list is correct. Yeah, exactly. So, so yeah. it's on Josh and myself. Josh, your first number forty-five. A very, a very Harold and Kumar three D Christmas twenty eleven. Oh God. <laughs> number forty six. <laughs> Number 46, House Party 3, 1994. Oh. Number 55, <laughs> The Hobbit, The Battle of the Five Armies, 2014. On number 56, Die Hard with the Vengeance, 1995. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, yeah, I got to go with Die Hard with a Vengeance. Yeah, Die Hard Vengeance should have moved on. I'm, I'm actually going to bear, a very Harold Kumar Christmas. I thought oh! that she was fucking... I ain't got a problem. I, I thought that was I thought that move was hilarious. Robot <laughs> <laughs> <Real, real, real, laughs> make you waffles. That shit was that shit was funny. Yeah, shit. yeah I haven't seen that one. Yeah. I I have not seen the Harold. I have not seen the Christmas one. Should have been in, should have been in three D. No, but it was yeah. you know, it was it was funny though. Oh, All Josh, right. you, Josh, you fucked up. <laughs> it's on me and CJ. I'm mm-hmm. um, first. We got number forty seven, Men in Black 3, 2012. Number 48, A Nightmare on M Street 3, Dream Warriors, 1987. Number 53, Spider-Man 3, 2007. Number 54, Balto 3, Wings of Chance, 2004. Yeah. I'm going first. Yeah. Emo Spider-Man. Yeah, no, that's what I'm picking. <laughs> I'm, I'm, picking I'm picking Emo Spider-Man. You're picking Emo Spider-Man? Oh, I'm picking Emo Spider-Man. Actually, honestly, you know, honestly on this I made that, that as a joke. But after hearing the other two, mm-hmm. yeah, that, that, is, that is, yeah, you, you know, people yeah, talk no about that movie, but that movie, yeah, really no choice. Bad. Like <laughs> Sandman in that movie looked freaking amazing. The graphics, Dude, were no, pretty Sandman high. was the only good thing in that movie. Yeah, Seriously. the rust. I mean, they put too much. If they would have made it about Sandman and maybe the suit, 
No, oh, no, no, no. The way they did emo Spider Man was garbage. Yeah, yeah. Man, it was stupid. If they would have made him aggressive and not like emo edge lordy. Yeah, oh dude, no, emo Spider Man was horrible. All right, yeah, CJ, like him gas, though. It made some good yeah. moves. CJ, uh, officially pick your pick, please. Oh, I gotta officially pick it. Uh, all right, all right, I'll pick. I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna. Pick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's a big burger TV. Prime time, bitch. <laughs> Welcome to prime time. Bro, that movie confused so many people because one minute you looking at that really good looking chick with the big old knockers, and the next thing her face is all Freddy. <laughs> <laughs> right. That tongue though. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, Dream Warriors. The best movie of the franchise, period. All right. And then yeah. last but last but not least is CJ and Josh, and this is the final group in this round. We got number 49, The Godfather Part 3. Number 50, Once Upon a Time in Mexico, 2003. Number 51, Rocky 3, 1982. Or number 52, Predators, plural, 2010. Oh, I'm going with uh, Rocky 3. And then Josh? And what other choices besides Rocky 3? Predators. <laughs> Predators, The Godfather Part 3, Once Upon a Time in Mexico. Damn, I, I'm sorry. I love you some shitty movies. <laughs> Not really. Movie Predators isn't that shitty. Like, yeah, it was. <laughs> no, because Predators is the one where they go to an island and old boy's a serial killer, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh. I'm that. You're thinking of the fourth oh. one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm thinking, yeah, I'm thinking the one where they where they all got put on the fucking planet. Okay. It, no, that's the one I'm thinking of. Is where they all got put on the planet to be hunted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, like that that, yeah, like that, it? yeah. No, it wasn't. Nah, it wasn't like a... Watch the fourth one, and your opinion of that yeah. one will change. <laughs> yeah. No, oh. no, no, re no. Resurrection was garbage. I do, do. I had the trilogy. I bought Resurrection. You know, we're not talking like, about elements. Yeah, we're just, talking about the set. Complete the set, and then I watched it. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude, Resurrection was so garbage. <laughs> okay, so we're on round two. Uh, Josh and myself will be first. Josh, you're our first in, in picking. So we've got Crockett Dundee, Los Angeles. Okay. Toy Story 3, Little Fockers, Logan. Wait, how the fuck is Crocodile Dundee Los Angeles still keep making it on this damn list? I, I mean, no, no, guys, you picked it. You, you picked it. One of you guys picked it. One of you, you picked, picked it. CJ? Yeah. No, you did, my fucker. Did. Remember? I just when did I pick that? I could swear yeah, I did not the, pick that. No, listen, it was Crackdown Den 3, Dundee, Friday, Friday 13th, Part 3, Beverly Hills Cop 3, and Little Fockers. You, you guys picked Crackdown Den 3 and Little Fockers. I pick little Fokker. Oh, okay. so I oh, mean, yeah, DJ no, picked no, it. I, yeah, I definitely picked it. Okay, I was like, I didn't pick that. Okay, mm -hmm. what yeah. are the choices again? Sorry. <laughs> Crocodile Dundee, yeah. Los, Los Angeles, Toy Story 3, Little Fockers, Logan. Oh, 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 shit. Three really the toys are not hard. Three. What are you doing? Um, oh, damn. I'm going with Logan. Thank you. What the hell? What's he so long? Yeah, Toy Story 3 is really good, too. Well, Toy Story 3 will move on. Yeah. No, and, uh, then, yes. Yeah. If yeah, yeah, yeah. you pick Logan, Jerry, yeah, Jerry would pick Toy Story 3. If you pick Toy Story 3, Jerry would pick Logan. You do, Mark. Yeah. Yeah. Dude. Yeah. Right. Hey. Yeah. yeah you got to remember who you're fucking working with. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> right. It's myself and CJ. It's, yeah. it's Alex Cross, Thor Ragnarok, taking three, Barbershop, the next cut. I am going Thor Ragnarok. Now I'm going over taking three. That's the worst one in the franchise. <laughs> it is. It mm -hmm. is the worst one in the franchise, but at the same time, it's still better than a lot of these other movies. Mm, okay. I don't mm. know. I, I, I kind of like the next cut. Um, mm. All right. C CJ, <laughs> CJ and Josh. Uh, the <laughs> Credit Kid Part 3, Captain America Civil War, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 3, Harry Potter and the Prison of Azkaban. Ooh. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. Damn it. All right. Oh, you know, this is an easy one. There's like this really is an easy one. No, <laughs> it, 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 you know, they, no, you would think that, but they like, Josh comes after me. 
Yeah, he's a wild card. <laughs> All right, we're not that wild of a card with these. Yeah, shows. yeah, I hate, I hate Tristan. All right, All right. Yeah, let, me give it, let me give it for one more time. Karate Kid Part Three, Captain America Civil War, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Three, Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. All right, I'm going with uh, Captain America Civil War. All right, you know, Josh. Just because CJ talking yeah, about it, no, I'm gonna no, fuck no, with him. No, I'm gonna fuck with him. I'm right. picking the. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. What? Oh, 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 that's right. I gotta see you later. <laughs> that's Josh, all right. Josh, what are you picking? What was the three again? Karate Kid <laughs> Part Three, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Three, Harry Potter and the Prison Azkaban. That's right. I was gonna pick the Harry Potter one. Okay. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. Okay. All right, so it's on me and Josh. If you did pay, if you did pay value, I was going to put Carl your son and tell him. <laughs> so it's on me and Josh. What daddy did. Josh is between D3 the Mighty Ducks, mm -hmm. John Wick Chapter 3, Roddy at the Next, Creed 3. D3 the Mighty Ducks. And I'm going Friday at the Next. All right. Uh, yeah. That, yeah. That, all right. That group makes sense. That makes sense right there. All right, this one me and, and CJ. All right, we got. <laughs> oh, no, I hate when you do that. Why, why are you laughing like that? We got, look who's talking now. Uh, I'm going to bring you a puck somehow. We got, look who's talking now. Star Trek Beyond, Saw 3, Avengers Infinity War. I feel like I know what CJ's going to pick. So I'm going to pick a look who's talking now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I knew the man I was out the ah, boat. My shit wasn't no, going to make it. No, no, I knew exactly what he was going to do. I knew it. So mm -hmm. I'm, I'm still between Saw 3 and for Avengers and Finny Ward. Fuck. Right. <laughs> I'm going oh, Avengers and Finny Ward. Yeah. yeah. It should have that day. Part of the process. But it was Saw 3, though. I, ooh. I, I love Saw. I saw my favorite quote unquote horrible franchise. Yeah, but, but yeah. yeah, but 3 wasn't the best. Dude. No, mm -hmm. If it was like Saw 6. Oh, yeah. Saw 6 is amazing. Body there, there, was oh. there was a major contemplation there. It saw, the, saw 2 and Saw 6. Oh, All right. Man. So we want CJ and Josh. CJ, pitch perfect 3. Star Wars Episode Six was turned into the Jedi. My Big Fat Greek Wedding Three, Guardians of the Galaxy Three. Oh, oh, easy, oh, easy. Return of the Jedi. It's Josh. Guardians. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, oh, Josh. Yeah, that was on. Oh, Guardians of the Galaxy Three. Yeah, that was, that was light work right there. That was light work. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, so it's on Josh and myself. Josh, you're first. We got right. Transformer Dark Side of the Moon, Back to the Future 3, Police Academy 3, Back in Training, or Mad Max Beyond Beyond the Thunderdome. I love me some Beyond the Thunderdome, but I think this is where we leave you because I'm not picking it. <laughs> um, um, let's see. Ooh. Should I go with that? I'm going to go with Police Academy. Good. I'm going to go back to Future 3. All right. All right there you go. I yeah. figured you would. Mm -hmm. figured yeah. you would. All right. No, no. And I'm not really mad at you. Those, yeah, those two for the solid picks. I was like, that, grouping, that grouping was crazy. All right. So it's on me and CJ. I'm first. We got Rambo 3, Iron Man 3, Batman Forever, and Deadpool Wolverine. Deadpool Wolverine. Fuck out of here. I'm, I'm first. <laughs> oh, shit. And I'm picking Deadpool Wolverine. <laughs> ah, you <laughs> you so Fuck. CJ, is it Rambo 3, Iron Man 3, or Batman Forever? Uh, Rambo 3. Oh, what the? Man, I knew I should have picked Batman Forever. Dude, fucking love movies, man. I should put mm -hmm. Batman forever. I ship it. I knew he's gonna pick Deadpool with Ryan. Holy rusted metal, Batman! Yeah, yeah. Holy yeah. metal, rusted. Yeah, 
Because yeah, Jim yeah, yeah. Jim Carrey's yeah. Riddler is one of the one of my favorite villains of all time. Yeah, no, he did well. Actually, no, actually, Jim Carrey is great as the Riddler. Mm-hmm. But then you know they wrote, but they wrote Two Face horribly. Uh, no, yeah, Two Face is no Two Face is not like that. Oh, I, uh, I hated that how they wrote him. So we got <laughs> CJ and Josh. CJ's first. We got Mage Runner, The Death Cure, Bad Boys for Life, Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End, Terminator 3, Rise of Machines. Uh, well, oh, uh, oh, World's End. All right, Josh. Go ahead, Josh. Pick one. <laughs> Where are the other two besides Terminator? Mage Runner, The Death Cure, and Bad Boys for Life. Oh, yeah, I'm going yeah, Bad the, Boys the, the, worst, the worst of all of them. I like Bad Boys for Life. I didn't mind Bad Boys for Life either. I mean, and then and memory sent me well. Somebody I know cried doing Bad Boys for Life. Yeah, no, no, they don't think it's no, you know, I was just telling something Tracy last night. Dude, it's a great movie if you don't think about the rest of them, but in the franchise, it's the worst of the franchise. All right. So Josh and myself, Josh is first. We got Triple X, the return of Xander Cage, 2017. Ocean's thirteen, Ocean's thirteen, Ice Age, Dawn of Dinosaurs, or Red Dragon. Ice Age. And I'm going Ocean's thirteen. Everybody knows the second Triple X, the best one. With Ice Cube. Yeah. With Ice Cube. Yeah, that one. I love that one. Wow. Uh, the first one's okay, wow. and the third wow. one's all right, especially because they did bring back Ice Cube's character. Dude, dude, but William yeah. Defoe killed it as the villain, and Ice Cube right. was just great. Right, I wish all he right. did more action movies. Damn, dude, 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 dude. dude, this is the blackest thing fucking Josh ever said on this show. Mm. Is sad. <laughs> all right, all right. It's on me. It's on me and, and CJ's. I'm, I'm first. We got Night at the Museum, Secret of the Tomb. Army of Darkness, Jurassic Park 3, a very a very Harold Kumar 3D Christmas. I am first. I'm going Jurassic Park 3. Oh, really? What? All right. Uh, what was it? Not in Museum Secret of the Tomb, Army of Darkness, a very Army of Harold... Darkness. Yeah, Army I know Darkness. that's one. Army of Darkness. Yeah. I should I, I should I should have whispered that one. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, the thing, dude, no. no. <laughs> and in my head, I was already trying to play art. Am I going to pick Army of Darkness or for Jurassic Park 3? Which one to do? Like, I, was already, I was already fucking about to say goodbye to one of them. I thought for sure you'd pick a Harry and Kumar. <laughs> uh, CJ and Josh, CJ's first. American Wedding, A Nightmare on M Street, Three Dream Warriors, X Men, The Last Stand, Predators. CJ's first. Oh, fuck me. Oh, all right, all right. All right, Freddy. We ro- we rode for hard for a long time, buddy. I love you to death. You know, hashtag fucking kids. But uh we're going I'm going with an American wedding. All right. We're well, American wedding. Josh. Mm, damn it. Pick what I want. What was the other three? A nightmare on M Street, X-Men the Last Stand, Predators. Wait, you picked American Wedding over Nightmare on Elm Street, CJ? Yes, we did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He dude, only picked I, it though because he knew I was going to pick Nightmare on Elm Street three. No, mm-hmm. I didn't. No, no, I always pick when, when if I had the choice of the four, what would I watch? And now, exactly. you know, yeah, and that's why no, the thing no, Nightmare on Elm Street would be my second choice. So, all day. And it's moving on. Wait, you picked number on three? Yeah. Oh, oh, hashtag fucking kids is still alive. Go ahead, hashtag <laughs> fucking kids. Uh, yes. Oh, we moving All on, right. Freddie. We moving on. And then the last one was Josh and myself. And Josh, your first. Okay. Le- Leave the weapon three, Rocky three, Die Hard with the Vengeance, Spider Man three. Die Hard with a Vengeance. Fuck. Ooh, you still move. Uh, All right. right. Then I'm going, three? I no, I'm going. No, I'm going. Lethal Weapon Three. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, Lethal I Weapon Three is pretty good. Yeah, I like I for a fact though. No, no matter what you pick, he was going to put for Die Hard Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we are round three. There's one one v one at the end oh. of this. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah. All right. Hey. Yeah. All right. Hey, for, all, <laughs> for all you guys listening and not actually watching, you know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I can't yeah. wait for the one. Yeah. No, Dre. Uh-oh. Yeah. Yeah, for all, you, for all you listening, you know, and not watching the fucking live, which you should be. Uh, yeah, yo, know, Dre, you know, Dre does his fucking beer with fucking Cocoa Bean. Cocoa Bean, Cocoa Bean, what? Hey, Just saying. Cocoa, what you want? Yeah. Uh, what you want? Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. So. Yeah, yeah. He like, he like, like Mike Lowry. <laughs> all right. Yeah. But Cocoa so, Bean. Right. <laughs> so, uh, so we are uh, uh-huh. round three. The highest seed of the movie will get a, a automatic buy to the quarterfinals. Like I said, there's a one, there's a one v one that I can't wait for at the end of this one. And so, Josh and myself, Josh, you're first. You got Taken Three, Toy Story Three, D Three, The Mighty Ducks, or Logan. Uh-oh. I'm going with D three, the Mighty Ducks. Oh and, shit! Okay. And I am going with Logan. Damn, I thought it was going to be Toy Story three and Logan. All right, that's good. I like Toy Story, but for nostalgia purposes, it's got to be D three. And yeah, that no, means I, that, I, I understand. I understand that though. And that means that Logan will automatically go into the quarterfinals. No, uh, as you should. As it should. Yeah. Uh, it's on me and CJ. I'm first. We got Friday after the next. Thor Ragnarok. Look who's talking now. Captain America's Civil War. Thor Ragnarok. I'm I'm first. (laughs) Damn it. Damn it. (laughs) And just for that, I'm going look who's talking now. Ah, I thought you were the G-Way. Fuck. All right. I'm going going with Civil War then. There you go. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. He knew, he knew, he knew what I was doing. <laughs> All, All right. right. So we want CJ and Josh. CJ, now you're first. We got Police Academy 3. Go Gotta go first. Police Academy <laughs> 3, back in training. Harry Potter, the prisoner of Azkaban. Rambo 3, Avengers Affinity War. Uh, prisoner of Azkaban. All right, I'm Josh. Affinity War. There you go. Mm-hmm. The fact that Infinity War wasn't first was, you know, wild to me. Yeah. <laughs> no, but you know, I knew who I was going with. Yeah, yeah. I already knew he was going to pay. Yeah. All right. So it's on Josh and myself. Josh is first. We got Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End. Star Wars Episode Six: Return of the Jedi. Ice Age: Dawn of the Dinosaurs. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Three. I'm going with Ice Age. Oh, well, bye-bye Star Wars, then, because I'm going with Guardians of the Galaxy 3. <laughs> bye-bye Star Hey, Guardians of the Galaxy is still a fucking, still a fucking space movie. I love Star Wars. Wars. Don't get me wrong, but I kind of knew it was going to make it super far. So Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, I think it could have with the two of us. Yeah, but, yeah. But there are too many other good movies, though. I took my inspiration from you. Like, if somebody set me down right now, it's like, which one do you want to watch? I'm going to probably pick Ice Age over Star Wars right now. It's right. good. I've seen it so many times, but I want to laugh. Right. Yeah, exactly. Like, right. yeah, don't be wrong, dude. dude. Return of the Jedi is my oh, Return of the Jedi is my favorite Star Wars movie. But at the same time, I know it's not the best one. Mm-hmm. You know? All right. Yeah, so yeah. It's, it's on me and CJ. CJ, I'm first. We got uh, Jurassic Park 3, Back to the Future 3, American Wedding, Deadpool Wolverine. I'm going Deadpool Wolverine. All right. Adam, uh, 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 you're running back again. Damn, this is a fucking Jurassic, Jurassic Park 3, Back group. to the Future 3, American Wedding. Damn, dude. Yeah, I this is not a fucking group. Dude, look. Mm. Fuck. American Wedding. All right. Man, so <laughs> oh man, dude. Oh, did I forget to say to get harder and harder? No, yeah, yeah. I was expecting yeah. it to like round three, but damn, now like right off the bat, like fuck. <laughs> All right, yeah, and then the... oh, 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 shit, I fucked up. Yeah. Oh, huh. yeah. 
Yeah. Six. Yeah, dude. dude my, right. my yeah, first choice in this for the round. Boom. Murder. <laughs> and now we're on CJ and Josh. CJ, you are first. Got Lethal Weapon 3, Bad Boys for Life, Die Hard with the Vengeance, Ocean 13. Ooh. Ah, uh, Die Hard with the Vengeance. Josh? Bad Boys for Life. Yeah, Not gonna lie. The fact that Ocean 13 is out right now. Hurt, hurt, hurt my heart a little bit. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, yeah, no, no. The thing is, you know, yeah, the thing is, I was actually gonna pick Bad Boys for Life, but then I, I, I mean, you know, I, I was gonna pick Ocean 13, but I wasn't sure what Jeff was gonna pick. <laughs> so, like, all right, all right, yeah, so, I so it's not the same what I say. We are yeah. on the 1v1, we all get a choice to pick. All right. Uh Josh, oh, you picked three. Yeah, so Josh picked last, so it's Josh gonna pick first this, this time. So we have a Nightmare on M Street 3 Dream Warriors or Army of Darkness. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> I hate the grit on fucking his face right now. <laughs> <laughs> So before I pick, before I pick, CJ, which ending you do you prefer for 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 Army of Darkness? No, you uh, you prefer the one. Which which one of the Army of Darkness endings do you prefer? Do you prefer the one where he comes back to his regular time, or the one where he goes too far, ends up in the future? Uh, no, no, I've never seen the future ending. Oh, okay. Look it up sometimes. Alternate ending is pretty good. That's why I'm going Nightmare on Elm Street. You know what? Just to fuck with CJ, I'm gonna make CJ pick. I'm going with Armory Darkness. Oh, I, I knew I was gonna do it. I knew that was happening. Because I care less. Uh, really oh, fuck. All right. Yeah. All right. All right. I can't be mad because if it was the other way around, I would do the exact same thing. I'm going Nightmare on Elm Street. I'm going Dream, War- Dream Warriors, baby. Dream uh, Warriors yeah, all day. Yeah, I knew you was. Dream Warriors all day. Yeah. Yeah, I can hear less. All right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we are in round four. Logan will all make me go on to the quarterfinals. The lower part of this bracket will all make go into the final four. Uh, so it's just my first time. So it's going to go me and CJ first. All right. We have D3 the Mighty Ducks. Captain America Civil War. Look who's talking now. Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. And you go first, right? I do go first. Nice. <laughs> you, you're waiting for me to fuck up. <laughs> uh, I do go first. Uh, yeah, I, I got I, I took it as far as I could go. So <laughs> I took it as far as I could. Uh, uh yeah, I gotta yeah, go. Out of here. I know yeah. you I, I, I gotta go Civil War. Yeah, yeah and I'm gonna print her as a man. Yeah, I, I took, yeah, yeah. You get the talk of bullshit out of here. Yeah, yeah. I, I took it. I took it as far as I could go. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, yo. Oh my god. All right. You tried. So, <laughs> CJ and Josh. CJ's first. CJ you got Ice Age, the Dawn of the Dinosaurs, Avengers: Infinity War, American Wedding. Galaxy, Gal- Guardians of the Galaxy Three. All right, Infinity War. All right, and Josh. Okay, so I have American Wedding, Guardians of the Galaxy, and what's the third one? Ice Age. Ice Age. Oh uh, shit! Fuck it, I'm going Ice Age. I kind of figured that. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we get that at uh, degree. Yeah. All right. In the bullshit and then, Let's go. Then Josh and myself, Josh, you're first. We have Die Hard with the Vengeance, Deadpool Wolverine, A Nightmare on Elm Street 3 Dream Warriors, Bad Boys yeah. for Life. God! Oh, damn it. Oh, oh fuck. Uh, just, Brady, just, we had that we had that run, yeah. bro. Yeah. We really I, did. I, we really yeah. had a yeah. great yeah. run, yeah. Freddie. Yeah, we had a good run. Hey, hashtag fucking kids. 
<laughs> but yeah, we gonna have to let you go. We gonna have to let you yeah. go. Um, your first. I am going die hard with a vengeance. Good job, because I'm going Deadpool Wolverine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We already knew what two was gonna win out of those four. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It, yeah, it was easy. Yeah, right, it was, easy it was just one of those two. When I heard the other two going against it, though, I was like, shit. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, no, no. We we knew what was gonna happen, dude. It was it was light work. <laughs> All right, so we are on the quarterfinals. The movie that automatically goes on is Avengers Affinity War. Or automatically go on to the final four. Yes. We get to choose which three. We all get to choose which three. Sorry, we all get to choose uh, each each one we want. And I went last, so CJ, that means, that means that, she, oh, that I'll go first this time. So... Yeah. The first matchup is Ice Age Dawn of the Dinosaurs versus Logan. I'm going with Logan. CJ. Oh, Ice Age. Josh, you get to choose. Ice Age. The disrespect. That that is bullshit right there. <laughs> the disrespect. I'm, I'm sorry, you're like. Logan was an all right movie. I Logan was I, the I second, I, I second best superhero so movie of all time. Logan the second no, best superhero no, movie of all time. Like, it really is. is no, so Logan's Logan right. amazing, but once again, how, how if you set me down happen? right now, it's like, so do you want to watch boring. Logan or do you want to watch Ice Age? Which both of these I'm going to pick Ice Age. I'm going to pick Logan. Ice Age. Like, Logan, I think Logan was a bunch of like, sitting around doing nothing no, or no. sitting around and talking. Bullshit. Only one I like. Right. 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 Okay. Well, then Don well, the well, Dinosaurs well, is well, Continental well, Drift. Okay, we go to, we'll, right. we'll keep it going. CJ, you're right. first. Die Hard with the Vengeance or Captain America Civil War? Civil War. Josh. Civil War. Civil War moves on, but for that third purpose, I would have picked Die Hard with Avengers. Die Hard with Avengers is fantastic. Mm -hmm. but really War, really first was. time seeing um, all of them fighting and then Spider Man making his appearance, just yeah. iconic. Under Wait, wait Spider Man made his appearance in Civil War? Yeah, yeah. yeah he did. He's like Under Rules, and then he shows Oh, I know. I was talking about Avengers. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, all right, yeah, Josh, no. you're first with this one. You got all Deadpool right. Wolverine or Harry Potter Prince of the prisoner Azkaban. Sorry, Harry Potter. I gotta go with Deadpool Wolverine. So I'm trying to think for myself if if I'm picking something that just just came out so fresh in my mind or nostalgia because that's what it is. Mm. Um, and you sipping Deadpool Wolverine. I'm gonna let CJ decide this one. I'm gonna go Harry Potter. Yeah. No. Yeah. I think. Yeah. I think I've watched like all the Harry Potter movies. Multiple times, mm -hmm. yeah, and none of them were as exciting as Death Wolverine. All right, yeah. so is that what you're choosing? Yep, Devil Wolverine. All right, so we're on the final four. The uh, winners will go to the final, the losers go to the third place game. Uh, who went first this time? Josh went first, so it's on me. Yeah, well, we already know what's last one here. Mm -hmm. So we have, <laughs> so we have, John the Dinosaurs, or Captain America Civil War. I'm, I'm going Civil, I'm going Civil War. CJ, don't you do Civil it. War? You, okay, I was about to say, um, just for prosperity, I, I, much as I love Ice Age, I would pick Civil War. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah, we know it's as far as I could. Yeah, dude, we know it's fourth place. <laughs> All right, CJ. Deadpool Wolverine or Adventures Infinity War? Oh, all right. This is actually a hard one. That's what she said. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, I'll, I'll go with. You know, I'm actually going to go with like, Infinity War. Josh? You know, I remember watching both these in theaters, and I had two different experiences with each. Just one, I went and saw with all the homies, two of you guys, and oh, well, you didn't make it with us, which yeah, was good. You, you didn't get the call. No, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. they were before, before us, Dick. You did. Yeah, I said that before y'all, and then they get the Coco 1 9. I'm happy about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was really, really fun. But the experience of watching Infinity War was really cool, too, especially 
sitting there at the very end, my eyes knowing, like, man, this next movie's gonna be hype, and seeing everybody and their mama just crying, I'm like, eh, eh, what's be- going on? Because they did not know what was happening. I was just like, mm, yes, tears. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mr. Stark, yeah. Mr. Stark, I don't feel so with Mr. Stark. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just sitting there, I was trying not to laugh. <laughs> I, I, I mean, no, it was emotional. I, Not during I that scene, because that scene no. was emotional for me, but at the no, end, I crying. saw that and cried in the theater. And I think Dre was there with me. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Mr. Stark, I, I, I don't feel so well, Mr. Stark. Mr. Stark. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm going to Infinity War. All right. So if Infinity War goes to the finals, let's do the third place game. Whoa, first. No, 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 no. What were you doing? Oh, I will pick. Oh, uh, we'll pick the Finny War as well. I mean, I, right, I love Clint Deadpool, sweep. but yeah, clean sweep. All right, all right. So let's do the third place game first. Uh, see, uh, ooh, Josh, you first. Uh, right. Deadpool Wolverine or Ice Age: Dawn of the Dinosaurs? Deadpool Wolverine. Deadpool Wolverine for me as well. Sweet, sweet. All right, so three, four. So they've got to do what's the best. Fellas, this is number 10. I'm first. It's number 10, Captain America Civil War 2016, or number 20, Avengers Infinity War 2018. Oh. I'm actually going to go Captain America Civil War here, actually. Really? I'm going to go, I'm going to go, I'm going to go Civil War here. CJ? Uh, Captain America Civil War 2018. You know what's going to happen? Yeah, I'm going to pity you. <laughs> I knew he was going to do that. Josh, you going to do that? Yeah, I knew he was going to do that. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I knew he was going to do that, man. Like, like, like yeah. I had I, I no did, doubt <laughs> in my mind that you was going to do that. So, look, look, look. I'm going to say it like this. Here's my reasoning. Because uh, they're both really good movies. I mean, they are. And they real. both have lots of people. I mean, Civil War is the first time we got to see most of the heroes that we knew in the MCU come together. And Infinity War is the first time we got to see all of them, including like the Guardians and everybody else come right. together. Thanos finally enacted his plan and everything. You know, um, Infinity War is iconic. Um, and honestly, at the end of the day, I, I do think it's a better movie than Endgame. Um, but that said, thank you, thank you. All right, just we're, for, yeah, you heard here, you heard here first. Right? Josh agrees with me, but we, yeah, yeah. We, 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 we don't all agree with that. Better movie than Endgame. We, yeah. we don't all agree with that. But that said, because of the fact that we get the first appearance of Black Panther and the first appearance of Spider Man, I gotta go with Civil War. Wow. Yeah, I, I like Infinity, but Civil War just there's some. I mean, it was the first one. Like it was the very no, no, first no, no, time no, no, we got to I, see. I, I I agree. You know, it's, it's a hard choice, which is why it I was. didn't want to make it. <laughs> I, I don't blame you for it. <laughs> All right. So number one, Captain America. Number two, Avengers: Infinity War. Number three, Deadpool: Wolverine. Number four, Ice Age. Shot, shot the dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Please read that again. I, I, I knew what he was saying again. Uh, Avengers: Infinity War, Captain. Sorry, Captain America: Civil War, Marvel. Avengers: Infinity War, Marvel, Deadpool, Marine, Ice, Ice Age, Marvel. Dawn of the Dead. <laughs> and the, yeah, what? Yeah. So, uh, so we got like, we got like, a clean sweep on Disney. No, because I think Disney. Ice Age is DreamWorks, right? Not Pixar. Uh, give me one minute to make sure. Yeah. Um, Ice Age is oh, no. Fox 20th Century, which, which is now Disney. Which is that? Oh, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Clean, clean, no, Disney. Clean, sweep on Disney. Yeah, yeah. okay, he was right. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, Disney all right. and all the wins. <laughs> oh, man. All right. With that being yeah. said, let's say our goodbye. Starting with, all right, yeah, there's your boy CJ. I'm glad I could be here with this because, uh. Oh, dude, this was fun as shit and a great time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And you know, yeah, and uh mm-hmm. you let y'all know, and we got uh oh we got some shit going on with two thousand journeys. 
And mm-hmm. we're about to drop some shit on it soon, so we're gonna be on the lookout. But like, deuces. Yeah, what's up, everybody? It's your boy J Time, aka Josh. And like CJ said, we got a lot of content that's gonna be dropping soon. So keep your peepers peeped. Um, in regards to my other podcast, Watch with Josh. I ain't gonna lie, I'm putting that on hiatus. I've had a lot of personal things come up, and it just was a lot more time consuming than I thought. It will be back at some point. Um, just not this Halloween, because Recapping a whole movie is a lot of work, and I don't have as much time as I thought I was going to have this Halloween. Um, anyways, I will be putting that out on the social media account soon, just to let everybody know. Um, but this was fun. I had a great day. Enjoyed myself a lot. All right. So, yeah, this was fun doing this, doing this, uh, doing this bracket. Uh, we said brand new bracket, so I'm, so I'm happy about that. Uh, be on the lookout for probably a little bit more brackets if I, you know, get to it because these brackets are. I know I say it a lot, but these are brackets are, are a bitch to me. Bitch How are though? <laughs> With that being said, if you ever want to come on to do one of these brackets, I would never say no. Just got to do a bracket that I already made because, like I said before, even though I love doing these brackets, these are bitch to me. <laughs> My name is DeAndre Robinson, and we are out. Masturbators is part of the I Did Not Make These Rankings podcast network, along with some other pretty amazing shows like An Evening at the Movies, Crime Rewind, Crush Gasm, Literature Reapers, Love is Black, Men are the Prize, Season to Season, The Simplest, and Toontastic Journeys. You can find all of these podcasts and more at idnmtrpodcastnetwork.com. Now remember, Masturbators is filmed before a live social media audience and it's a mature show that talks about mature things it's not kid friendly but if you want to listen with your kids that's on you we warned you have a good day